up and we've got all our joints all nice and uh, set up there. Next step is we want to get our template, template number two, and we're going to mark out the hole where the um, pinball, uh, the ball launcher is going to sit. So I'll just put the box like this and you put your template in, line it up there on that uh, the plywood uh, line. You can drop a line in here. We'll put a dot in there so that we've got a we know where we're going to be marking out our drill hole. Next thing is what we want to do is we're going to actually just mark along here wait, 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 wait. like this and like this. Okay, and quite easily then we can just run the ruler across on this side. So we have a line there. And we're just going to mark out on the other side here. Yeah, we're going to draw, we're going to end up going across from to there, one over this side. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're now going to cut, and we're going to cut this off with the bandsaw or the scroll saw, and then we're going to use the jack plane to jack plane it down to the line so we get a nice little slant on that. So I'm going to pull this apart now. Okay, uh, just put it back. We're just going to cut this down. Uh, so guys, now uh, you'll see now that we've got a, a high side, so the line is a little bit higher on this side and a little bit lower on that side. So basically we can just get the jack plane now, and when we jack plane, we're going to actually jack plane with the jack plane at a slight angle. So we're going to get down to that, those lines there, so I'm just going to... Getting very close now, that's good. Okay, and I'll just reattach that back in. <coughs> when do you guys want to help? And what you should actually get is a really nice edge on that now. Oh, thank you. Yeah. So it fits in just really good.